was begging for a straight drop shot there from Masaro. Tough rally. Masaro loves the boast at the moment. Yeah, third time a charm. They're taking their prowy up to the court, up to the top of the court. Almost there. But I think we can see a definite strategy taking place here from the English woman. So you have to make sure you move with it as you hit the ball. Absolutely. Uh, what Masaro. That's going to be a stroke. Movement straight back from El Defuari. There you go, there's confirmation. Well, we're going to get a video review, but I think he'll remain as a stroke. Sorry, what were you saying? Uh, it's worth it. Well, you might as well, yeah. Just what? Just prolong things? Pro <laughs> <laughs> I think this is going to stay as a stroke. Ball, ball not tight, loose, coming through. The line for Masaru was straight through Elda Ferrari. Her movement was straight back, so it'll stay as a stroke. So that was good from De Fuari because she took the ball in and then she was up, pushing high up, waiting for the loose shot from Masaru. Actually guessing right there, but Masaru had her wits about her, made sure she evaded the volley. Because she got the width. Well, it's a nice attacking yeah. shot from El Ferrari. Further away. Whoop. Here we go. There we go. Old, old Ferrari Entertainment. Well, it's a wicked boast from Masaro. Game ball for Masaro. It's a nice attack from Lord Masaru, who comes through the back door to steal that second game. So having trailed pretty much all of it, 11 minutes, 11-9 for Lord Masaru, and she now leads Kanziel Dafari by two games to love. Makes a huge difference. Can't believe she got that ball. I can't believe she got that. Not, wow, of course she did. Of course she is. Why wouldn't she get all those three shots back? Oh, well, the, the dive didn't get there that time. Great rally from both players. Kanzio de Ferrari, so mobile, especially within the dive. Gets up so easily. Incredible stuff. And she, she was actually waiting for the backhand. 
she got out of the dive, just sat back and waited for the backhand stuff. Swing of the elder flower. The referee said he can't hear her. Oh, that's a beautiful, what a good angle that we had on that uh, straight drop there from Massaro, too. That was quite a treat. Well, all credit to our director. Because the ball was clinging to the side wall. So, 10 minute third game, Lord Massaro taking in 11 7, which meant that Lord Massaro, number two seed and defending champion, defeats Kanzi Eldafuari, three games to love in 35 minutes. Well, the final moments, ball clinging to the side wall at the back of the court. Adafari not able to get the ball to the front wall, so Massaro books herself into the second round. Probably the perfect first round match.